I want to ask y'all something, but I don't know how y'all like, feel about it. Also, but I'm genuinely curious. Go ahead. You want to type it on first, on. or is it not bad? No, it, it's like not bad. It's kind of just like like was it like it's a kind of like a question like was it difficult or you just kind of got used to kind of question. Hmm. Asked like like RP on the server. Um. Yeah. It's about like okay. Basically, like you know, people that have, I don't know who's been around the server for that long, but like you know, being in like a game like CG, right? You have like someone. Oh like, my God, Jar Jar. Uh, Mr. K. Was it difficult for people to recognize you as a person, or were you like always like a kind of a yes and kind of person? Like this is I, I don't know how to explain it, but like in a in a situation where it feels like yeah, you guys are being recognized all together, or was it just like you're being recognized by because someone was like, you know, bigger, like a like a bigger, like had a bigger audience, and you were just kind of just like, well, you, I don't know how to explain it, but you get what I'm trying to say? I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, I was just basically saying okay, like- right, so what were we saying? Like, you know, how, like, you know, you know, RPing with the, the people and like the slow, like how it takes some time to get out your shell and, you know, like if you're in big groups, you know, how do you get known as individuals and like what's the process? When you have of like that? big personalities and shit within yeah. the same group, I think it's a. I think that's a cool thing to be fair, because it, you know, what I'm saying like, it, it, it's uh, it, it makes you better. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, I don't like, know. I, I notice I think, I'm I'm more quiet. Like I uh. I don't shine as much when I'm around the CG boys, I think. Really? Yeah. I feel like I'm more quiet and I don't I don't talk as much, but when I'm uh when I'm like with you guys and stuff like that, I'm kind of make I I feel like I'm more like running. Shit. I do more of the talking and I I yes. blossom more. But who who So you Does think that that's a Curtis, you think that's a Curtis thing? I guess so, yeah. It's like more like what is it like a comfort thing for you? Like I don't know. I couldn't explain it. Um no. I mean, I guess it's also kinda of like he feeds off the energy we give him, right? Yeah. Well I give uh, energy I give Curtis that big dick energy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like I've 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 noticed oh, a man, lot I'm of joking. times joke, like joke, even joke. even like I remember one like scene that I set up that was really good is like when uh Somebody, I thought somebody was stealing in my company, right? And I bring them all there. And then I set up this whole like scenario where like Dean and his boys come up and like they, uh, they drop this guy off to me or something like that. And I, I kill them in front of my employees because that was my way to scare them Damn, to, for them Curtis. to never do that again. Right. And like, just like stuff like that, like having that creativity, all that stuff. I feel like I shine more when I'm able to like, just be like, I don't know. It's weird. It's hard to explain. I guess also like in the same sense, it's very hard. I think even for myself to maybe be in like the same kind of area in like the server, it seems like other bigger streamers. Because it's like, you want to have a chance to RP with this person, right? But you also want to don't seem to come up as like, you know, you know, be like looked at as, oh, this person just wants to be annoying, be involved and a leech, quote unquote, or whatever the case may be. So it's kind of just like a seesaw kind of thing. Like you want to, you know, have RP with that person. But at the same time, so you don't want to be to seem like be in their kind of own bubble that they've been comfortable with. Oh, you're talking so about it, coming off as a cloud chaser or something. Is no, that what yes and, well yes and no this is kind of like a little like moving on like, oh no, we're no, moving no. on this, so this wasn't your original because i still no, remember i still don't know your original no, no, no. my original thing was like do you feel like mm. in a sense like you know like mr k like we'll just use him as an example like feeling like you did you ever feel like you were like recognize like as yourself like your rp as an individual or did you feel well, like i mean i used to be the demon like so i was recognized okay. for that i would say okay yo what's going on guys make sure you like comment and subscribe your support means the world to me i really appreciate it peace out i was okay. pretty big i was big in 2.0 i was like a bigger in 2.0 like i would get like 
two to three K views. You know what I mean? Like I was definitely bigger back then. Um, but coming into 3.0, it's definitely different. I took a back seat. Uh, I feel like I wasn't myself. Like I wasn't my normal, like RP self. I feel like I catered more to, uh, worrying about how people thought OOC instead of just kind of doing what my character would do. You know what I mean? Um, I felt like I took a backseat on a lot of shit and it kind of hindered me. So um, are you going to bring that guy back or what? Well, like I, we talk about, like it's scary to bring that shit back, right? I, because I you never say, know what's going to happen. Yeah. You never know if people are going to be able to handle I feel that. Like Curtis, I feel like Curtis can get away with it. Like he, because it's like been nah, his. Thing. Nah, nah. I, I know what Curtis is talking about, bro. 2.0 Curtis is different from 3.0 Curtis for yeah. sure. Yeah. Lean boys, Curtis, bro. Like, mm. bro, this guy, bro, it, you, bro, this guy was, they call him Demon of Lean Street for a reason. Like, you know yeah. what I mean? That that character cannot, in my opinion, you're right. In 3.0, people feel some type of way about that. I agree. Right, and it's hard, bro. Unless I'm a fucking, you know, like Zolo, like even CG 2.0 were so much more ruthless. Like today, yeah. 3.0 would not be able to handle that. I'm actually sorry, Angel. You know what? Go ahead with your. That's my bad. I kind of you there. What no, were you I saying? Think it's also, no, you're fine. No, no, no. I think it's also just like I didn't. You didn't just understand what she was saying. But yeah, I apologize. I don't. I didn't want to like take the reins there. That was. No, you're you're good. Um, I'm sorry. Like I couldn't like explain it better. Um, it, it's like kind of one of those questions where like I don't I know what I'm saying in my head, but right, I don't know how to put it, it into words. Yeah, yeah, I feel that. Um, I think I kind of answered it though, right? Like a bit. I think so. Yeah. No, you did. Yeah, you kind of did. I perfectly answered that. Like I kind of are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I did. What was your other one though that you're about to ask? Um. Well, like the whole, I don't want to say like, I hate the word cloud. I don't know. I just really hate that word, but right. I guess a, attention, um, does it feel like sometimes like, or I don't even so, remember what I was going to say. Okay. Well, I can tell you about this. Like, okay. So okay. back in the day when Ming was actually a bigger deal, actually Kevin and Ming were like the two people that would get like the most views. And this was like back in like 1.0. Um, I was like pretty cool with ming like I, I got along with him i like we we found each other naturally with an rp i didn't really know about the guy um and we just vibed but then i seen like i was like oh this guy's kind of like a bigger deal like this guy's a big deal like and i'm like fuck so i actually didn't want to like ever call him or anything like that like i didn't want to make the first move because i didn't want to come off as like a cloud chaser or anything like that i didn't want like chat yeah. to be like oh look at this fucking guy you know what i mean like so yeah. i would never want to make the first move i'd always want like him to hit me up with an rp and that's like an ooc thing because i didn't want it to be taken as like this oh, this guy's just like cloud chasing you know what i mean yeah so i can see like where you're at with that and like being reserved in that fact because like you don't want to be portrayed in that way potentially yeah if that's like where we're kind of headed with this conversation yeah. i don't know if this is what you were talking about no but no that's yeah like, that's kind of like yeah it's kind of a weird position to be in but then at the same time it's it's like maybe sometimes you just got to be like well fuck that and kind of just if if uh if people are enjoying you and are enjoying your rp and everything like that then it's it's a mutual thing and you kind of have to worry less about what the chatters are saying, which can be a very hard thing to do, especially if you're hard on yourself. I can agree yeah. with that, actually. And I feel yeah. like if the streamers, like, doesn't see that way, like, at all, exactly. like, then you should be fine. Saying. Yeah. Because, you know, the viewers are going to say whatever. Viewers are like going to say whatever, bro. Like, like, big streamers' chats will talk shit about whoever, bro. Like, and they'll just say random ass shit. Like me and me and Zolo get flamed in fucking Kevin's chat all the time, bro. And they don't even know half of what the fuck they're talking about. Or they don't know the full extent of the situation, right? But they'll still just fucking flame, bro. They're only watching one POV. They're only hearing what their streamer's saying. That's it. They don't hear anything else. I agree.